In Nigeria, a young inventor has been making waves with his jaw-dropping inventions. From vacuum cleaners to microscopes, water fountains to spaceships, Timile Hidaomi has found a way to build a solution for problems around him. This next report tells us more. Others may see a pile of rubbish, but Timile Hidaomi sees a potential store for materials for his next science project. It's a literal case of one man's trash being another's treasure. It was from a dump site like this that Timile his sourced materials to build a vacuum cleaner to help with house chores. Anytime my mom asked me to go and sweep, I, I didn't like sweeping. So I had to create something that is going to be even more easier for me to, to just take and start it and start sweeping. Even I am I'm thinking of making this as a robot that can, if I just switch it on and just start sweeping itself. Simi has also channeled his inner Einstein to build a digital microscope, an invention he created to prove to his sister that ants have six legs. The light there is to make more light to the, to the base here, for it to be visible to the, to the lens over here. The lens from the camera, this one from the DVD room, and each, this one is for it to be movable around the base here. Timmy has also designed an electronically controlled water fountain made of calabash balls, batteries to pump the water, and even flowers for aesthetics. He's designed a prototype of a spacecraft, a mini power bike, a power bank, among others. His father says there are more inventions in the pipeline that are sadly been stalled by lack of funds and electricity. The project is just the first indigenous aircraft built in, in, in the whole of Africa, which he, he's trying to build. That is, is going to source all the material locally, everything 100% Nigeria. And the, 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 the aircraft will, be, will carry human beings, not just a toy. To date, we are being hampered by fund. Otherwise, uh, we will have rolled out that project. Again, we are also being hampered by electricity because many times we, we need electricity to work. Despite challenges, access and power, funds and the internet, Timmy's imagination continues to drive him to create possibilities from scrap. And at just 18, his scientific exploits have won him $3,000 at a science contest, awards for outstanding inventions and a scholarship. Anetta Felix, TV360, Nigeria.